Hello folks, this has gone spy, the spy will come in online for the Transformers for the final time as we have come into a approaching final stand of a one on one fight between hero and villain, between machine and machine, between one faction that fights for good and the other faction that fights for evil. And after from the last episode, when Bumblebee and the rest of us thought it was over by defeating Barricade, we all were shown otherwise when Megatron shown up out of nowhere behind us. And then when Bumblebee wanted to try to protect Sam and Michaela, Megatron swiped him away and Sam and Michaela were on the run protecting the AllSpark. Right now, this battle is coming to a close as the casualties of both Decepticons and Autobots are starting to rise, but only, and there's only one Autobot that can be able to stand against Megatron, and that's the one, the only, the leader of the Autobots, and the Autobot that believes freedom for all sentient beings, not just humans or Autobots, but all sentient beings, all species alike. It is a very sentence that is underrated for all time, that surpasses time itself, and he is known as Optimus Prime. Which is something uh, that it should be, uh, how it should end it. Brother versus brother. A brother that fights for good and a brother that fights for evil. It's been a long time coming uh, since uh, we've got started on this little journey adventure. And already uh, we are on the approach end of this uh, of this great moment, of this great day we are at, of this great weekend for Halloween. And even though that we are in a holiday, or of sorts, when most people wouldn't want to think it as such, Halloween is going to have not just the fear or chaos and destruction, but it also has this burning bright that shines throughout the darkness, the burning hope of liberty, of its wings that flies out from the shadows and into the field with its burning heart passion of a hero. Rome and and for the time that I've watched Optimus Prime at work and when I've seen what he had fight fights for and why he would give so much I admired so much about Optimus Prime and if I would choose any one of the heroes that we should have in our time I would pick Optimus Prime and if there are many more of us that were like Optimus Prime the world will know peace and that we would have freedom for all of sentient beings. One way or the other, this battle will come to an end and we must be victorious no matter what and we will be victorious no matter what because Autobots and humanity stand united against the darkness that the Decepticons brings upon our world. If Megatron gets a hold of the Allspark, all of humanity will be lost forever. The flames will be extinguished, which is will not going to be happening because Optimus Prime will be the only one that stands in chance against Megatron. And so now, without further ado, for your special gift for Halloween and for the end of this chapter, we will see once and for all if this channel is going to rise above the occasion to the challenge and that the Autobots would either be victorious or would fall. Either way, we will find out in this one last battle. No. Ha. This ends here. And now This has to end here, Megatron. Heroic words, Optimus. So fitting they shall be no less. At the end is day, one shall stand and one shall fall.
and the crimes for your man team. And we'll be the ones that deliver the hammer of justice straight to your ass. <laughs> Not today. Flame froze too. All right. Have a dream. We'll see him. Have a poll? You have done enough whiplash for one day or for one night. Your chaotic plans is not going to be fulfilled. Let's go. <sighs> it's over. Finally.
Wait. Look out! Oh no. Sam! Gotcha! Now come here! That'll make him stay down for good. Now it's over. For now, the Decepticons are defeated. And though it came at a heavy cost, fate has yielded an unexpected reward. A new world to call home. We live among its people now, hiding in plain sight, protecting them. For freedom is the right of all sentient beings. Yeah, that definitely sends chills to my spine. <sighs> Alright, folks. So that's pretty much about it for this level, folks. So, um... Let's see what's up next. I guess that's what I should be expecting. Alright, folks. Um, Hope you like your Halloween gift. And um, I apologize that I couldn't be able to finish this uh, episode since last weekend. Uh, but it was like... It was getting uh, like close to like to the end of what's uh, of what's about to come to a close here. So um, yeah, that's pretty much about the ending of the Transformers series of this gaming until like um, if the channel gets to a certain point of of creativity and a certain point of it of of. Making a surprise, awakening it whenever there's going to be another Transformer gaming series for the channel to show you guys. It's going to be like sometime in the future. I don't know when. Probably not, probably so, but either way, I give you my word that I'll make it happen one day. But for now, once the credits comes to an end, I will be seeing if I can be able to like show you a video about about what's going to be happening on this weekend Halloween because well because I was better prepared, better prepared for how this Halloween this coming this time around because I got like a cool costume I wanted to show you guys something that you guys will be so surprised to see about and um I'm going to be like uh, be like uh, passing the candy to the kids to the children to teenagers alike uh, and in the neighborhood so um yeah, that's what's going to be happening on this weekend, and then, and then afterwards, soon after this video, where my family will be going bowling for a little celebration for Halloween on for today, and then tomorrow we'll be like even giving out the candy for the for the neighborhood, which I will show a video about whenever I get the chance to. So I really. I really do appreciate you guys taking the time to watch the to watch the videos of Transformers. It really brings it really brings to the heart that you guys would want to watch the videos of Transformers, even though they're not exactly what you call movies or such. But it's getting but as as I told you before, this is like like better close to the movie the first movie of Transformers that you've used to watching. So um. I hope you guys enjoyed them as much as I did, so, yeah, so, yeah, um, pretty much about all I can say at the, at the, at this time, so, well, I'll be doing a Decepticon campaign, huh, Cybertron, Autobots, <sighs> um. Well, that's surprising. It's probably an epilogue of 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 the Autobot campaign, but um, we'll see what's going to happen if I take 
if I take this now if this is an epilogue well actually no this is really the final video of the Transformer game series and that's just a uh, a bonus uh, of challenge of wave after wave of d enemy Decepticons in that, uh, in that mission or of sorts so um yeah, that's pretty much about it about what I can do right now. So, about now, there's another gaming series that I want to be able to put on the channel, but um, I'm going to have to tell you about that at a later time after Halloween and for the announcement for that because it's a little bit timing and complicated to be able to show it to you guys. So, um, yeah, so, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. It's been, like, a good time to see the great awesomeness of equipness of what this gaming series have in store. And just much as, as much as the movies and TV shows have to offer of animation. So, thank you guys for enjoying the journey of the transformers of autobots and and i will catch you later for halloween whenever i get the chance to or for my next breaking announcement for the next gaming series i will put up in my channel so happy halloween guys and and hope you like this gift i offer you so happy halloween guys this has gone by the spy offline from Transformers for the final time.